We begin this half hour with a piece of long-awaited good news when it comes to homicides in Kern County. 17's Moses Small joining us now in studio to explain. Moses, good evening. Jim, good evening. We're halfway through 2022 and data show local homicides are down compared to last year. But our community continues to suffer from violence. 17 News data shows a small relief for our community, historically plagued by violence. At least 54 people have been killed so far this year in Kern County. At this time last year, that total was 63. Killings within Bakersfield city limits dropping by 35%. This year we're at 20 homicides. At the same time last year we were at 31. We had two consecutive years of record homicides in our community and so uh, to have some downward trends at this point is really good news. Bakersfield police say homicide totals may be going down because of efforts to stop gang violence. These crimes account for 30 percent of murders in Kern. We have developed some community partnerships really around gang violence and those uh, those type of homicides and we've had some really good work out of our partnerships and community members who are alongside the police department out on the streets trying to make a difference. Pastor Manuel Carrizales founded Stay Focus Ministries to curb gang violence. He says the solution starts with steering young people away from dangerous lifestyles. You know we got kids that have grown up in our program that that were uh, traumatized because their dad or their mom was killed. Walking with them through it, it's a process and to make them realize that they're valuable that they were never made to be a gang member, they were never made to be a drug addict. If you want to learn more about Stay Focused Ministries, we'll put information on our website, kget.com. In studio, Moses Small, 17 News.